Welcome, 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 collective. This is Queen here back again with another intuitive general energy read for the collective. Remember, only take what resonates and leave the rest. I don't know what's coming out, but we're going to see. Um, thank you all for tapping in. Um, hope you guys are having an amazing day, amazing night, evening, whatever time it is in your neck of the woods. If nobody says that they love you today, I love you today. With that being said, family, we're going to hop right into this message and see what the divine spirit, spirit guides and the ancestors um, have for us at this time. This is a timeless message. Only take what resonates and leave the rest for someone else. If it does not resonate with you, please share. Um, maybe it will resonate with someone else. All right. So let's tap in collective and see what's here. Holy Spirit, what are the messages for the collective? What is it that they need to know? What is it that they need to be aware of? Holy Spirit at this time. For the cosmic gods and goddesses. Thank you. Messages for the collective. I'm hearing moving on up to the east side. I don't know where it's coming from, but maybe that got something to do with this message. Somebody's moving forward with courage. Okay. Somebody's ready to be adventurous here. What else is here? I don't know if you're moving to the east side. Uh, this the east side of where? I don't know. But it's something to do with the east side. Somebody needs a break, okay? Somebody needs a timeout. Oh, well, something's making somebody, like, really want to just, like, take a break from something here. Okay? Somebody's feeling at a loss here. What's here, Spirit? Somebody's feeling at a loss here. I'm also getting the... Somebody wants to take a break because there's something they don't know. Okay. I don't know. Let me see. Get one more. One more spirit. Let's see. Here. Somebody needs a break. Somebody's growing weary of something here. I don't know. Somebody needs a break from somebody that they're in a relationship with I don't know I'm getting love and roses but there's something unknown something behind the this love something behind this joy this this I'm I'm hearing supposed love some type of surprise some some unknown thing like Somebody needs to take a break. It's making somebody literally sick. What is this? Somebody feels like they're drowning in a black hole or something like I don't know, falling in Oh, okay. Somebody's feeling real insecure. Okay. Somebody doesn't know something and they have a burning desire to know whatever this is. Whatever this unknown thing is, okay? Whatever this surprise is, okay? It's love and protection. There's something about this that, about this love about this surprise somebody needs help somebody's under judgment because they're feeling like somebody doesn't love them somebody's not smiling today all right this is could be past present or future energy something's ending somebody's tired of going round and round with someone here oh it's the energy i'm getting here Let's see what this person has to say. What do they have to say, Spirit? Somebody feels like somebody's been too private, too um, confidential, keeping things from them. 
Okay, too confidential. Somebody's back and forth and there's... Somebody's not knowing why somebody's going back and forth. But they keep doing it. But then they're leaving somebody needing help. They think that this person is okay, but they're not. They think that they're showing this person love, but this person is not feeling love at all. They're feeling like they need a freaking time out here. Okay? And are they smiling today? Heck no, they're not smiling today. Because somebody's keeping secrets. Somebody's being too damn private about something here. So what is this Holy Spirit? What would you like for my beautiful collective to know? Somebody's needing somebody here. Needing them to be open. Needing them to, I don't know, help them heal. Give them some type of help. I'm going to give them some type of understanding. What do they want to say, Holy Spirit? Hmm. Something either going to be successful or something's either going to end here is what I'm getting here. Okay, we have, I wonder if you're enjoying life more without me. So whoever this is that needs a break is wondering if that person is enjoying their life uh, more without them or would they enjoy their life more without them. If somebody uses material things to hide their true self, to mask their true self. They hide behind possessions, the material things, and yes, flowers, gifts, loves, but somebody still have a broken heart here, okay? Wow. They enjoy the surprises, but wow, the gifts or the love or the way that you protect them or the way they protect you, they're very kind. Somebody thinks that somebody is being very precious, but at the same time, they're being too private in this relationship. And this person needs a break. They're starting to feel fatigue because of there's so much confidential, private things going on behind the scenes. And somebody's uncertain. I'm getting that somebody doesn't realize that person is needing aid, needing some sort of help, and they're starting to judge this person like, you show me love, but do you see me? And this person's not smiling. Even though this person tells them that you're the most precious thing in my life, somebody's partner is wondering, are you enjoying life more without them? And over here it says I'm using material possessions to mask my true self. Because this person is picking up on this person is, is really feeling like you guys are not suited for each other. Okay? And this person, no matter what they show you, you don't love this person. Wow. I'm getting that somebody's in separation here. Somebody's definitely in separation. I keep recording our separation over and over again. Give me one more. Somebody need a certainty in this relationship. Wow. Somebody thought something over time they hardly be healed. Wow. Somebody would bring back that same energy of love, joy, of happiness. But somebody's starting to feel the real about the connection here. Somebody doesn't feel like they belong with somebody here. Y'all yeah, know I got to keep it 100 here. I got to keep it real. Wow, I use my work as a way to move on from you. So somebody trying to move on from somebody. So what's this karmic up to, Spirit? The rhythm is off. The uncertainty is there. Bringing something back to life is like a, a fucking... Um, I don't know, it's a mystery, you know. They can't seem to get the passion back. 
no matter how much time go by. And somebody's not smiling because they feel like somebody's keeping some damn secrets, keeping shit too private. You know, the unknown, you know. They may show this person or tell this person that they love them. They may share with them with gifts or, you know, very kind to them or tell them that they're so precious and they're so protective over them. But yet and still leaving somebody's heart vulnerable, wide open for this pain for this heart mending that needs to take place. Hmm. Somebody wants harmony. Okay. Somebody wants to be accepted. Somebody doesn't feel stable. Somebody is not okay. Yeah, it's kind of like, yeah, I'm going to pretend like I'm okay, but I'm not okay. Yeah. There's no joy, no love here. You may be kind to me you may you know be precious to me but i don't feel the love i don't know, i think we're suited for each other yeah somebody is i don't know they may have some type of um what is this I don't know, I'm hearing talent, hitting talent, I'm really putting on a mask, okay, to make things appear to be okay when you're not okay, your hands are fucking full, you're tired of doing things all by yourself, wow, material things isn't love to this person here, is the unknown. Is what keep is is what keeping is what's keeping things off balance here. No matter how many gifts this person presents you with, you're not okay. They think they're talented, like on the surface, but inside you can feel that this person doesn't love you. They have their eyes set on someone else. Somebody wants to leave a family or a relationship here. Somebody's person has gotten pregnant by someone else here. Okay, and they wasn't ready for that here. They definitely didn't plan on wanting this to happen here. Okay. Wow. So maybe collected, maybe this is why you're having this gut feeling here. Okay. Wow. Now this wasn't planned is what I'm hearing. Or you wasn't planning on this person to do you this way. Because they masked it real good. They're very talented at masking things here. Okay. They tried to be very st strategic about not letting you find this out here. That they've been venturing out, okay, to see other people. And they're very talented at masking things, okay. Well, this person really doesn't want to be bonded. Even though they they give gifts. This could be you or them or somebody in your energy collective. Only take what resonates and leave the rest here, okay. Well, wow, somebody just wants to be loved here. Okay, somebody needs some certainty about this, but somebody's not ready here. Somebody is a thief when it comes to love. Love is blind to this person here. Love is blind. And this promise here was just that they wanted to help this person. It wasn't love at all. Mm. One more spirit. It wasn't love at all. Somebody just feels responsible for somebody, but they don't love them. Wow. Somebody feels like they're tricked into a relationship here. I don't know. And they didn't see that there was some sort of danger ahead here. Who are these two people? Are they not speaking? There's a group that collaborated to put this commitment together. I don't know. And they did it on purpose. There's some type of devastation here. Somebody did this uh, expecting to devastate someone here. Someone they didn't care about. Now this person's feeling lonely. Are going to be feeling lonely. Okay, because of a, you know, decision that somebody made. Or they're finding out. 
okay, why they've been so confused or why they've been so full of worry here. Something's been bothering somebody here. Wow, somebody can't sleep at night. Damn, that person is in a third party. Possibly got somebody pregnant here. Yeah. Hmm. Something's at disarray here. Like, somebody can't find the evidence, but they know that uh, something's not growing inside of them. And something's not growing in the relationship. So where is these seeds being planted? Is what I'm hearing. Well, I'll be darn. Thank you, Spirit. What else is here? Oh, somebody tricked somebody, lured somebody into a relationship to cover up something else here. What else is here? Oh my, hold on collective. The download I just got was somebody's person. Oh my God, somebody's person. And please don't take this person to collective because I'm only the messenger. Somebody's person thought they couldn't have children. So this person went out and either had a, got pregnant by someone else and their person believes that it's their child. I don't know if this is past, present, or future energy, but this happened. Somebody thought their person couldn't have children. And they went out and got pregnant by somebody else. And they have their person believing that this is their child. Wow, that hit me like a ton of bricks. Wow, I wanted to transfer a minute. Hang on, collective. What's going on here, spirit? That's why they don't want you to see something. That's the unknown part. This is not your child, whoever you are. Even though your person did it out of love, it was it was all for the wrong reasons because none they're realizing that you two were not suited for each other. And they use the material things and the possessions to to hold on to you from masculine I'm getting that this karmic film did this to hold on to you and then they're using their work or whatever it is that they do as a way to get away from you to stay you know not spend time with you and you're wondering why because they had this child they were so happy that this is going to be unconditional love. That, you know, they were going to be responsible and all this shit. But now nah, there's somebody else involved in this shit, baby. Somebody fatigued because they're pregnant by somebody else. Oh, masculine. This karmic film ain't pregnant by you. Whoa, that's what she's been keeping a secret. Oh, she been keeping the secret that she wanted to please you because apparently she's thinking you can't have children. You could, you, you could possibly could have children. Just wasn't time yet. So she went out and got pregnant by somebody else and told you it was your child. So y'all could live this happy life. And now she's realizing, this karmic film is realizing that you guys are not suited for each other. And they're starting to realize the depth of their relationship and why they did what they did. And that they use material possessions to mask their true self. And now they're using their work to move on from you. This was our plan. To build a family. To give you something they thought you couldn't have. But they got pregnant by somebody else. Oh, wow. Somebody may have even got married to somebody. Thinking that this 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 person by them getting pregnant would bring some sort of success, but the only thing it did was bring it in, or it will bring it in. I don't know. I'm saying warning. Something about a diary. 
Maybe the dates don't add up. I don't know. Hmm. Wow. But I'm saying two couples here. Two different couples. Does somebody else have a a child and tell them that actually by somebody's best friend and tell them that it was theirs? I mean masculine, did you have a partner out there that was close to you and your your girl and that your girl confided in your partner and told them that you couldn't have children so they decided to blindly, unknowingly do this to you, sleep with them, your partner or a stranger, and presented a child to you and told you this child was yours? What the heck? Wow. What else is here? What else does the collective need to know? What do they need to be aware of? I'm saying something about a warning. Somebody's been keeping notes. Maybe the date was off. Timing was off. The queen has fallen off her throne. That's what I'm hearing. Got together with the wrong person. Unknowingly. This person could have been setting a trap for you and your person, feel masculine. Or just to get your karmic female pregnant. Because she sure went for it. This could have been somebody's karmic ex too that got them pregnant. Because their new partner thought that you couldn't get them pregnant. So they got pregnant by the ex and they're telling you that you're the father. Wow. Trying to make you a victim here. Tricked you. Yikes. Telling you that you're the responsible one. Oh, wow. And that you should possibly marry them. Somebody here is not married, y'all. They thought this baby was going to bring it all together. And this person was just going to accept this shit blindfoldly and not ask no damn questions. And you want me to be your res responsible parent? Wow, because somebody could have to move and give up everything just to be with this person that they believe is pregnant with them. Wow, they could have a location change. Or the things could physically change. Or they could just be moving or having to sell their home to get a bigger home. Thinking that this child is theirs to and this your fucking partner's child. Wow, somebody else you don't know is their child. Uh, the old karmic feminine show got bring by somebody else. And they mad because what don't happen. They realized that y'all wasn't supposed to be together. Okay, with well, the karmic and somebody's ex got somebody's karmic pregnant. They ex got them pregnant. But this karmic is with you now, masculine. Divine masculine. And she telling you it was your child. Want you to marry her. And it's all been done in the dark. Like they think that you gonna walk into this unknown and believe this shit. But you about to have an awakening. If it wasn't your karmic ex that got this karmic film pregnant. That want to trick you into marrying them. Wow. Or trick your person into marrying you. Um masculine because you do have another relationship going on with somebody else it is they just want you to be responsible that's confirmation from spirit somebody tried to trick you masculine trying to lure you into this fucking trap to be a victim to say that you the baby daddy Lord. somebody you that baby daddy yeah if you that but you ain't that baby daddy what the hell Somebody, they had a queen that's falling off her fucking throne on this one. They try to interrupt with your relationship, with your new relationship, because this tramp, all of her emotions and shit, wants you to walk into something blindly. Coming, coming, you know, 
onto you, you know what I'm saying, thinking they can come towards you. Why? Because they all in their emotions because you was somebody else now. They want to come up with this. Um, well, you know, I'm pregnant. Mm, 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 mm. But see, somebody been keeping some kind of journal, some kind of record, some kind of, I don't know, some type of information. This person has been sleeping a lot. Oh, if your person been sleeping a lot, they pregnant by somebody else. If they've been feeling fatigue and having morning sickness. Masking that's not your child. You may have been around them. You may have called them because you was somebody else now. And they want to mess up your relationship. Because they feel like a fucking clown for... for well, they should. They don't get embarrassed because you're going to find out it's not yours. They were only in it to break up your relationship. It was a motherfucking plan that was playing behind your back here. A strategic plan that failed. Why? Because somebody was in their emotions. This fucking clown here is embarrassed because you married somebody else. Now they want to holiday pregnant. But then they got pregnant by one of your partners or somebody you don't fucking know. Just to interrupt you on your new person here. Mm, mm, mm. Every time they see your person's car and your driveway or they see y'all somewhere together. It triggers this person. If you bring up this person's name, it triggers this person, your ex or whoever this tramp is. Wow. Wherever you may be. If they see a car like yours, it triggers them. Because they're embarrassed. They're embarrassed to show their fucking face. Because, see, they were still obsessed with you. Now they want to trick you with the with the pregnancy thing here because they see you happy with somebody else. They see that somebody else is in a commitment with you and possibly a proposal is ahead or possibly even a marriage. And this karmic over here been keeping tabs. Now she done got pregnant by your partner or somebody you don't know and want to come and tell you that it's yours because they see you in a new relationship with somebody else. Yeah, they're going through it. They going through some type of mental breakdown. They do not want you to, to be in a, a marriage or an engagement with this new person you with. Uh, masculine. Yeah, this person feels lost. Okay, they feel lost. They feel cut off, ghosted. And the only way they could trick you was to uh, tell you that they were pregnant. Because you may have blocked this person. You may have cut them off. And you with your new baby or your new boo. You know what I'm saying? And this person want to try some... Dumbass strategic shit by coming up with the most favorite thing a female come up with. Um, not slicing and dicing y'all, but some of y'all, y'all be some cutthroat motherfuckers out here. Y'all know y'all be pregnant by these men. Y'all be telling these men that because y'all be jealous of the other woman. Okay, not y'all collected, but these bitches be doing this shit out here. That shit ain't cool. These clowns. That's what fucking clowns do. Try to lure men in by telling them they're pregnant just so they won't be with you, um, Divine Film. Uh, masculine, that, that, you're not the puppet. <laughs> you are not the father is what I'm hearing. Okay? It was somebody else that made love to that hope. It wasn't you. You are not the father. Oh, you're going to be finding this out real soon, too. You can find this out in the near future, the next couple of days or the next couple of months, that you are not the father. I'm hearing you are not the father. Oh, my goodness. Why would she play games like this, spirit? Tell us more about this karmic energy. Mm -mm -mm. What else is here? Thought you just, you know, like believing and, and running. They can just pull you back until they like this karmic wants you back because they feel lost without you. This karmic ex. Okay. Alright. Somebody you dated with in the past here. They feel that you blocked off. Yeah. They want you to come back. They see you have left them or something. Wow. But they have been stalking. When I say stalking, because they have a fucked up obsession. Okay, if somebody could have been married to somebody, and then I want the divorce to be final. It could be just about ready to be final. And there's a couple that's gotten together here from Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine. Now here come this karmic ex that want to say she having a baby to try to pause some shit, push shit to a halt. 
but her plan gonna fail because that used to be queen that fell off her fucking throne. Now the bitch is princess. And see, you a queen now, Divine Film. You said princess? What? Bitch, I'm a queen. Like, yeah, now she ain't princess status. She in that little girl status over here. Playing a little childish ass games and shit. What else is here? Because she in denial. She's in denial that she can't pull your person back from you. She can't pull your person back from you. She in denial. Let's see what fell. Well, quite a few. Mm -hmm. She's in denial. Wow, this might have been mm, somebody you know. Somebody you network with. Man, this 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 karmic film. Like <laughs> she she could want something that she could wow. She wants something uh, bad to happen here. Because she can't face the truth. She's been too irrational. She's in denial that you have moved on and got you with somebody new. Got you somebody new. You blocked her motherfucking toxic ass off. Now she want to play the pregnancy game here. And the bitch want to... She networking with familiar friends. Our family, just to get around you to put a curse on you. The bitch might have a voodoo doll. See these pins and shit stuck in this thing here. She might have a voodoo doll. Oh, and it landed right on top of the strategy. And, um, shit, your new person may be getting pregnant if they ain't already pregnant. Divine masculine. She's mad, but, see, the most high is going to make things fair in this situation here. Because the bitch just lost out, whether she in denial or not. Yeah, justice is here. Yeah, she gonna end up with some legal matters if she tries something stupid here. Cause you didn't put an offer on the table with her ass. Her offer been set on the table that you left the bitch divorce is final. She don't want it to be over. She wanna pop up and say she pregnant to stall some shit. She's been very irrational. Yeah, she can't face the truth that she's a loser. She's a fucking loser. Wow. What's your spirit? For being love or whatever she tries to do to to um, you collective film masculine to try to destroy your relationship. Well, this bitch used some type of Sticking pins in a fucking doll. I don't know what this shit is. Blowing smoke. I don't know what she's trying to do. Some type of hex or whatever. Cause some type of catastrophe or something like that. And your relationship with your new person. By saying she's pregnant. Yo, if you're wanting to have a child. Your new person that you got with is going to have your child here. Wow. This is what I'm getting here. You and your new person is about to have a child. As a matter of fact, if your new person wants to go to the doctor, they found out they are pregnant now. And this karmic ass third party, they wish they were pregnant here. And they see you moving away from them. Okay. They met because they thought they were supposed to be a twin flame, but you got away from their ass, okay? But they want to be back with you, but you ain't speaking to their ass here. Because you... You know, they played you. They're trying to play you again here. Yeah, today. Yeah, this is this is in the moment. This is now. But ain't no negotiating. You ain't trying to negotiate nothing with this damn tramp. That got pregnant by your partner or a fucking stranger. Want to tell you that's your child. All right. Yeah, somebody about to spill the tea on this bitch's secrets here. Okay. Wow. She done went out and had a thrill with somebody else and they want to come and try to say that the fruits of the labor is yours. No, it's not. You are not the father. You ain't the pappy. <laughs> she just trying to ruin your relationship. This karmic trying to ruin your relationship because she miss you. She miss you. Oh, well. She should have treated you better when she had you. Archangel Michael's protecting your new relationship here. 
Well, if you got somebody new, uh, feel masculine here. Wow. Or this could go either way. This could be masculine or feminine. Somebody's masculine could be trying to tell them they're pregnant by them and it ain't them. And somebody's feminine could be telling somebody they're pregnant by them and it ain't theirs. Whoa. Either way, you're done with this ex. Why don't they be gone already? Oh my goodness. Archangel Michael's protecting your new relationship and protecting you. You have no worries. If you're in a new commitment, yes, it's protected. Yeah, and this karmic is done. Archangel Michael has his eyes on her, preventing this uh, uh, person from doing anything to you or your new person. You have protection, okay? You have protection from any sort of harm, okay? From this fucking drama queen here. Wow. Oh, what else is here? They might be networking and collaborating with others to try to pull your person away from you, be a feminine and masculine, just fucking karmic, because they in denial. You know what I'm saying? Want to cause some chaos or whatever, but they're going to end up with some legal issues. Archangel Michael's protecting this union that you're in or that you're about to be in with someone else. But I'm I'm hearing that's not your baby. That's not your baby. That's your partner's child. Your ex went and got pregnant by your partner or a freaking stranger because they didn't want y'all to break up. They see you in a relationship with somebody new and they want to come back in and try to cause some conflict. Yeah, I told you they collaborate with other people. But so they know they blocked off. They blocked off. And the sad part about it is they got their little dirty little secret that they had they had a relationship with your partner or uh, one of your close friends or a fucking stranger that got pregnant by them. And they come pretending to tell them they pregnant by you. Hoping that you would, you know, show them some unconditional love like you're showing your new person. Or that they could be certain that it's love or something like that. Yeah, that's why the fatigue came out. That, that ain't your child. She may be fatigued, but she fatigued because she pregnant by somebody else or... Damn, that's what I'm getting here. Y'all want to trap you because she fucking frustrated. Yeah, she thought she played you. She thought she'd get you right on in and get you hooked back up with her. Wow, on some retaliation shit? What is wrong with this idiot? Put some payback or some revenge because you don't want her no more. She want to keep you way down with a child? Oh, Lord. How low can you go? That's what I hear. How low can you go? How low can you go? And she don't know she can end up in a lot of trouble for this shit. I don't know. Yeah, this is your past lover. This ex. Yeah. They want to pop up. Tell me I'm pregnant. We supposed to be together. We supposed to have a family together. The fuck is wrong with this bitch? <laughs> Doing some dirty shit, right? Because this bitch out here is single. Thirsty like a motherfucking dog. You know, I want you back to buy masculine or to buy feminine. Take out resonate that got pregnant party with somebody else in the nightlife. You know, out there this could have found somebody fucking random and got pregnant by. I don't know, the bitch was just fucking anybody. Why she hears a song that remind you or, or remind her of you or him of you or whatever. Shit, this this bitch like wow. Hey. She did whatever made her happy with whatever. Who because and whatever with who made her happy at the time, that's who the fuck she got pregnant with. Okay. Damn, and she wanted more. Yeah, because she know the person she got pregnant by don't want her ass. That's the crazy part. She know the time is running out. This karmic film know the time is running out. Now you gonna see this baby, I'm telling you. <laughs> you going to know this ain't your child right off the bat. If she ain't had it yet, or she could have possibly had this child already, you know it ain't yours. You may be taking this to for the court. You may be taking this this cow to court. You hear me, masculine? Because she only did that shit since she was pregnant to start some shit with you and your person and with you, divine masculine and divine film. That's why she did it, but that's okay. Yeah, Archangel Michael's protecting this so this bitch cannot. Yeah, he's keeping her blocked off from coming towards y'all. And any type of boy, she, if anything, she's going to wreck herself, trying to wreck y'all relationship. What's wrong with this psycho, psychopath, sociopath, ass, devious ass? Ooh, loser. She's a loser. 
She's a fucking loser. What else is here? Tell us more about this damn drama queen. Uh, now she has success or something, but she only ended it, ended herself. This karmic did. Thinking your person's the only one supposed to be with her stank ass. Yeah. She been having adventures with unknown motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? The reals with unknown people. She don't got pregnant by one of them. Oh. Mm. She thought she'd tell you that she's pregnant by you and y'all raise a child and have a happy life. Wow. Y'all can have a new beginning. Y'all can have a new beginning. Y'all can be happy. Joy. Remember I told you the roses, the flowers, all the good shit. Yeah, the bitch missing now that you gone. But you was somebody else. And the bitch is broken. And that's the only reason why she's doing all this bullshit. Trying to keep you tied down. You know what I'm saying? Way down. Anchored down with her. Stank butt ass. Well, on some payback revenge shit. Punishment. What the fuck? Why don't she move on down the road? Uh, what's that song? The dining house. Move on down. Move on down the road. Yeah, I hear somebody telling her, move on down the road. Keep it moving, bitch. You don't fuck my best friend, my partner, or you just out here fucking unknown motherfuckers that have thrills with them and shit. So you can trap me up. You better get the fuck on. Wow. I don't know. Yeah, she broken, but she ain't trying to show it. Okay. But I'm picking up danger twice because I picked up at this card and I seen the word danger. She might be trying to cause somebody to have an accident just to get you on separation from your person here. Okay? So watch that bitch, okay? Because she want to restart with you. Okay? Wow. From masculine. Or he want to restart with you. Uh-huh. Somebody you had history with. Where the fuck this dizzy motherfucker is or this dizzy bitch? Uh, the black magic ain't working. This bitch don't know what to do. <laughs> Oh my goodness. What else is going on here, Spirit? <sighs> Ain't no negotiations. You don't want this person in your life. You got somebody new. Alright, feel masculine. And here come this ex to my. I got a baby on the way. I'm feeling fatigued. And I da because she don't want it to be over with. Well, guess what? It's over. Because you are not the daddy. Wow. No. You're not. You're not the daddy. Okay. This bitch just want to cause conflict. She over negotiating with herself. Spirit said, bitch, quit negotiation. No. This person's not the daddy. A little candle magic and moon magic backfire. That shit didn't work. The bitch sitting around broken now. Okay. Yeah. She's going to end up with some liquid issues if she don't slow down. Okay. Wow. Wow. She want to cause you some pain. But the thing of it is, but she hated the fact that you ran away or that you got away. You set yourself free from this karmic, okay? And now this karmic is, karmic is wishing that you hurt yourself or either she's going to tell you that. She's going to tell somebody that you hurt her because she broke and she's going to fucking tell a lie. And she's going to end up, she's going to end up in trouble. For pretending. She's going to end up. In court behind this shit. Wow. For trying to come after you. This person maybe. Not want to let you go. Feel masculine. And want to come up with some. Type of. I don't know. Some type of information. Or some type of cause you some type of trauma. 
That's what I see. Because they look, weren't looking for love elsewhere, passion. When they explore other people and want to take you to court and say, sure, baby. The bitch did a curse that didn't work. Okay, well, she better be friend the unknown, okay? Because she's under judgment. All right? Time is up. This bitch ain't got no control over nothing. She might as well stop pursuing you because it's, it's not going to work for her. There's no second chances for this bitch, okay? Yeah. The cycle is over. This bitch is old news. Why don't she get the fucking message? You are dedicated to the person you with now. Wow. You and your person that you with now, your energy matches. Okay? Everything that this bitch did, you know, behind your back to try to do towards you and your divine, um, feminine, divine, masculine. Oh, this bitch about to be exposed in court. Okay? Well, all this hope is gone for this bitch. Time is up for this bitch. Ain't nothing moving. Okay? Wow, this might... I don't know. This bitch might be thinking about this. I might have been planning this for some, some while. Some time now. Thinking about it. You might not even have seen the bitch and she gonna come and say she pregnant. Well, I heard that well ran dry. Right, bitch can't probably... You know what I'm saying? Like... What's the fucking purpose? She don't even have a clear purpose. And ain't even money. This bitch just broken inside. Wow. But she ain't gonna get nowhere. Cause you still gonna be happy with your family. And like I said, your divine film could end up pregnant on um, by you unexpectedly, divine masculine. Why this bitch running here talking about you the daddy, you ain't the daddy. She fucked your partner or a stranger. This bitch went on a, a, a <laughs> An adventurous sexual escapade. Okay. Wow. And she wanted to have success with you and it ended. And she went out screwing other people. That's what happened. She's not going to get what she expected from you. Or expecting, you know, you to trust her. Or expect that to be good news to you. you like, what? You better keep it moving. I am not attracted to you or your secrets. Your dirty secrets at that. Okay. Yeah, this, this, I'm telling you. Whoever this karmic ex is, is trying to be unpredictable. But she's going to follow her ass in a black hole with this secret because, hey, she wanted you in despair. She didn't want you to be with your person. She wanted you to lose your person. She didn't want you to have this foundation with this new person. But Spirit says she out of time. Wow. For trying to either get you to reject your person or separate from your person or leave your person. Because it ain't going to end. You with your new person or your new person is coming in. Y'all going to be together. And this bitch going to have to back the fuck up. Okay, is what I hear. Yeah. I don't need her being jealous or trying to camouflage somehow. You her baby daddy or, or he the baby daddy or some bullshit like that. No, this is all talk. All lies. That's what I hear. All lies. The bitch is delusional. Okay. Wow. Mm-mm-mm. This is crazy. This bitch is just, you know, feeling a lot of pressure, pain, anxiety, and discomfort. You probably got she pregnant by your partner, though. Okay? All sluggish. Or whatever. Wow. But she's so focused on you and your motherfucking uh, life with your new person. Yeah, she's on a burnout is what she is. That's why she's feeling fatigued now. Because I don't know whoever she got pregnant by, they might not have been well. You know what I mean? They might not have been well. But she's so busy focused on you that she has created a world of unhappiness for herself. And she didn't want you and your new person together here. Wow. She may be confused. <laughs> but the universe ain't confused. That's what I hear. Wow. She just created a whole lot of challenges. This karmic ex can, you know... Create a whole lot of challenges for herself here. She about to fall in this dark hole she wanted to fall into because she thought it was some type of potential there for y'all to have some type of love connection again or whatever. Wow. Mm -mm. Spirit is blacking her off. Yeah, she she's somebody you can't trust. She she knows that she probably somewhere laying on the floor sick now by your partner or by your best friend. 
I felt masculine or uh, the bad feeling. Yeah, this bitch could be pregnant by somebody else. Somebody she pregnant by your man. Nah, she down on the floor now in the fucking days. Yeah, trying to figure out who is the baby daddy. She don't even know who the baby daddy is. <laughs> All the people she met up with. She don't know who the baby daddy is. Wow. She thought she could keep everything written down, like strategically written down, planned out. You know what I'm saying? Like I slept with him on this day, I slept with her on this day. You know, back and forth, being feminine, masculine, versus energy when necessary. Wow, she can't even remember who she slept with. She don't know who the baby daddy is. She can't recall. She trying to recall, but she can't recall. Oh, but that's all right. Yeah, that bitch is slowly gone, like, get the fuck out y'all way. Okay, because that sperm right there, that wasn't yours. <laughs> All the white spirits show that to me, like, yeah, that wasn't yours. You was far away from this bitch when that happened. <laughs> yeah, when that shot off, you went nowhere around. Okay, or when they shot that off in, in, in this karmic film, you went nowhere around. Or when they said that your ex... That you getting rid of, and she coming up to my she pregnant by your person. No, uh uh. It did not hit her to create nothing. Okay? Your person was too far away. Be a feminine or masculine. It was a gap there, yeah. Wow. That is, you are not the father. Like, I'm just here. You are not the father. Wow. This bitch just wants your freedom. She wants you to still be in captivity or some shit here. But shit. I'm telling you, Archangel Michael is here protecting your relationship. She's going to be met with some legal issues because justice is here. Yeah, because she pursued the wrong person. Okay. Yeah, spirit's confronting her and she's going to be made to confront her worst is fear. And that's why she's going to be broken when she finds out that she's pregnant by somebody that she don't even know who the fuck she's pregnant by. Wow. That's what I have for you now. Until next time. Namaste for now.